Criticate! We lost another fucking episode. Yeah. Because someone forgot to press the record button. You were in charge of recording now. We switched seats and you said, I'll be in charge of recording. And then I, I know how and, it happens. And then, you, and then you moved the keyboard and I said, is it recording? And you said, yes. I moved the keyboard here between us. And you walked over and you checked out the stats on the thing. I was like, are we recording? And you said yes to me. I did because I thought we were. We're, we're done arguing. <sighs> So we lost another episode. We lost of another episode. <laughs> so here's what happened. We're in the mysterious east. Ugh. Still, and I mean, nothing really happened. We did the, the we did another one of those slide puzzles. Yeah, we, we that's we about it. Slid all the things into piece. It was really boring. Yeah, I don't think we talked about anything interesting. We only got like five minutes in before we know. Yeah, so yeah. It's, we so did, it's not that, that bad. much. So what just happened is I walked inside of a painting. Yeah. Uh, and so this is what's gonna happen. Alice can move, jump, and normal, mm-hmm. and you be careful to move. Avoid has. <laughs> yeah, the game turns into a 2D platformer uh, now. What? <laughs> you can still do your jump. You can still shrink. Oh, God. But it, you can't it's attack. Pretty. It's pretty. Can I kill myself over here? It's like peach. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, you can kill yourself. Which, yeah, you don't wanna, want to, I guess. Let's see how far I can go out. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> can I still collect the peach? Or do I just have No, it? oh, yeah, it's, cool. just a, it's just one tooth. <laughs> Me too. Yeah. Are they called peaches? They they're peaches and then they turn into teeth. This is really pretty. I guess, but it's I so kinda, janky gameplay wise. Is it? I haven't gotten any like big well, platformy bits yet. No, no. It's just why have a two D platformer in the middle of a three D platformer? because uh, it's cute. I don't know. I like a lot. <laughs> you you have your thing about you don't like mini games that that differ too much. I, I, I don't. Think they're a neat change of pace. I like cohesion in mechanics. Well, the co- cohesion, the mechanics. There is, there cohesion. is here, there is here, because it's the same mechanics. I just think it's weird. What? You, you touched the fireball. Did I? Very, ever so slightly. Huh. So, <laughs> so I just have my thing where oh, like, shit. That was my bad. if if <laughs> if you're confident that your game is fun, why would you ever need to deviate from the main mechanics of the game? Just to break up the monotony i guess but your game shouldn't be monotonous it's a game it should be fun well i mean in the end so, <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't even matter yeah yeah i mean it, as long as it's fun who gives a shit yeah but i i think that a lot of these segments and shit end up not being fun well that's yeah that's that's an issue with the game itself i don't yeah. think as a as a I think as an idea, this is fucking cool. Uh, Going into a painting and then doing a little a little cool Japanese as segment. A, it looks cool as shit. As a so. rule, I don't like it. But there are exceptions. I'm not saying that across all games, mini games are bad. Uh-huh. I'm just saying that for the most part, in my experience, mini games have ended up being the least fun what segments. What the fuck? Oh, it touched, it touched the Touched the spikes, yeah. Ugh. <laughs> Why have the spikes at the bottom if the waves kill you, too? <laughs> fucking No, the waves don't kill you. The wave killed me. No, touch you the touched the spike. Oh, there's one slightly there's jaggier one. There's one there. slightly jaggier one, and you're not on top on top of that thing. God damn it. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Oh, hey, bud. Yep. I like this. You I think do? This is super cool. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. I, I do not. I think it's beautiful. But being beautiful isn't a good game uh, thing. I think, I think I honestly am liking the fact that I'm just jumping between things and not fighting things. I'm sick and really? tired of the combat. <laughs> so well, that's I think fair. this is breaking up the pace a lot with something that at least stimulates but, me visually. But that, I don't think it's amazing gameplay wise, but it's yeah, fine. Yeah, exactly. But that leads, that just shows a problem in, in how the combat's designed. It doesn't show that this part's fun. It's, it says that that part's yeah, well, bad. Yeah, no, I'm agreeing with you. Yeah. Yeah. I just like this to break up the pace of the game itself. I guess. I think this was the right choice for this specific game. I, I don't think so. I think the right choice would have been rework combat. Oh, yes, but I pro- <laughs> they probably had a big time constraint. Maybe. I time, don't know. It's an outsourced company. And it's, it's an really outsourced janky, company. So. You know what? At the end of the day, I just don't like it. I just think it's it's just a bad design choice. Uh, I, think it's, I mean, it's like, think it's yeah. at least? Uh, kind of, I don't know. I think the, I think the 3D segments are prettier, and I don't understand why. I I, I don't understand why <laughs> <laughs> they thought this was necessary. Do I go over here? Oh no, you oh. go up. Oh shit! Sorry. Oh shit! What up? Ha 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 ha! If you don't know, we really love the Jared Leto Joker laugh. <laughs> I really like Jared Leto Joker as a humorous concept. Yeah, as like a meme, not like... Well, I, he didn't do a good job. No. I know plenty of people that are just like, 
I liked what I saw, but I'd really like to see more. And I'm like, I really? don't want to no, see more. No, I did not like what I saw. <laughs> I mean, it's mostly our friend of the show, Matt. Oh, and oh, okay. He, he, he has a very, like, I'll give anything a chance kind of view on things. Sure, sure. Even I think it's the point <laughs> where I'm like, and, and you know me. like that's, Yeah, you'll give a lot of things a chance. Yeah, but, ugh, Jared Leto's <laughs> Joker is. It's, it's pretty bad. I mean, I think they proved pretty pretty clearly that it's not good. Yeah. I feel like maybe he should have should have spent less time sending people dead rats and uh, yeah. spent <laughs> more time uh, practicing acting. Right. And not just being a shitty Jared Leto that goes that makes cat noises sometimes. Yeah. Uh, also I, I wanna I wanna take some of the blame off of him. I think that some of that's direction problems. I don't think so. Because uh, the rest of the acting is directed relatively competently. Yeah, maybe I'm just being Overly hopeful. No, 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 no. Oh, <laughs> shit. Maybe I'm just being overly hopeful, but part of it, part of it is a lot of writing choices, too. I mean, it's not his fault that they decided... Well, apparently he improvised a lot. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, then fuck him. Yeah. <laughs> but also, like, it's not his fault that they decided to tattoo him the fuck up and give him weird braces and shit. I don't think that's David Ayer's fault, either. It's just probably not. I think it's... Zack Snyder's fault, yeah. more likely yeah. than anything. Zack Snyder, the best director of all time. I think he's got some good movies, though. <laughs> he does. But having good movies doesn't excuse doesn't his excuse bad the ones. Shit ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I overall think. Have Have in I told general, you? Oh, go ahead. He's a competent director. Yeah, yeah, it's just yeah. Sometimes his movies just aren't good. They have bad <sighs> writing. They have bad issues. Yeah. And and some of it's direction, but a lot of it is not his fault. And especially when he's doing a universe, you know, it's not. <laughs> all his control there's shit that the studio and w wb is w, fucking right brain dead yeah that's that's true so studio intervention is a has been a big issue but with DC. For, for dc specifically but I, yeah. I i was about to mention uh i think bloated media is the name of the channel put the real name up if that's not it uh but he, he does the what if star wars were good videos um you know the ones where he's like he he. I've he, never seen him. Oh, okay. He he does like a, a series of videos where it's like theoretically, how do you make the prequels good? The prequels and, can be easily pretty good. And, and he does a good job. Yeah, but he tells like an entire real story. He basically rewrites all the prequel trilogy, and it's really good. Yeah. Um, he he has a series of videos also less popular, uh, called Fun with Zach, where he <laughs> reviews Zack Snyder's movies. By making a little skit where he hangs out with Zack Schneider, and Zack Schneider always drugs him and takes his twelve fifty. <laughs> uh, does Dan Schneider show up? No. And God. take pictures of his feet? No. <laughs> then why watch it, Jacob? Because it's fucking hilarious, and he does a whole one. Like he'll he'll at the end he'll like. Am I supposed to shoot this? No, you're supposed to. You're supposed to move something. There's something. Um, that you shoot that moves the the things. Do I, I think titties? you do not. God, that's a weird <laughs> fucking statue. Oh, I statue. gooped her. <laughs> <laughs> I think there's something you're supposed to shoot that turns that thing. Uh, can I? You can't get over there no, yet. That looks too far. Yeah, you're supposed to. You're. Sp oh, there's a oh, thing down there. What the fuck? Come on, <sighs> Zach. <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> Everything is Zach Schneider's fault. <laughs> it's Snyder. It's not Schneider. Snyder. Oh, yeah, because he's he's not. Schneider. He's not Dan Schneider. Yeah, I know. I still, I, I, there's no difference for me. Mm -hmm. So sometimes I, I miss. Speech. There's no difference between Dan Schneider and Zach Schneider. No, none at all. They're the same person. <laughs> <laughs> they direct basically the same thing. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, but no, I was, I was going to say at the end of, uh, at the end of each of those skits, he'll do like a thinly veiled criticism on like while he's being drugged. Ow. So like on, on the end of the first no, one, stop. You, you're <laughs> at the end of the first one, Zach gives him a, a smoothie. And it drugs him, and he's like, "This is a terrible smoothie." And then it's like he's saying "movie," but, but like slurred. <laughs> they're, they're fantastic videos. I love them. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh, stop! Stop! Stop, game. Oh my god, I'm gonna vomit. Don't stop. Just like stop Don't. doing that. Stop. <laughs> no. Because I'm having a okay time. <laughs> I'm having a perfectly average time. Uh, <laughs> I want to. I want to die is what I was going to say. I figured. Hey, Zach, Zach, stop. Oh, it's Zach. Oh, it's Zach. Zach's here. <laughs> He's Zach. He's Zach. He's a Lego maniac. <laughs> oh, that was the other thing that came out this week. The uh, trailer for the, or that I watched this week. I don't mm -hmm. know if it was already out. The Ninjago movie. 
Oh, yeah, there's been plenty of trailers for it. Yeah, yeah, I had never seen one, though. Oh, it looks really good. It actually does look pretty good. I don't know if I'll see it in theaters. But yeah, no. Because, <laughs> like, oh, Batman, it's like everyone's going to see that because people care about I Batman. I still haven't and, seen and it. Be, oh, it's really good. Yeah, I heard that. I mean, yeah, I'm sure, yeah, I'm sure you yeah. heard it. <laughs> it's, it's, a, it's really funny. Yeah, I'm sure. And, it, and you're able to watch it if you haven't seen... Um, uh, if you haven't seen what's it called, uh, the, the Lego, Lego movie, movie? Yeah. yeah, you you're, you'd be able to watch Lego Batman just fine. Hmm. It'd be a bit confusing because they start bringing in other Lego properties at the end. Oh, okay. So like Batman fights Sauron or something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. And he fights fucking the Kraken from uh <laughs> <laughs> from Pirates of the Caribbean. No, like from just... uh, from uh, Clash of the Titans. Oh. <laughs> so it's like so it's, it's cool. some cool shit like that. Yeah. Uh, he fights Voldemort too. <laughs> <laughs> Basically a bunch of WB awesome. properties. Yeah, yeah. But uh, yeah, no, that's it's good. It's really good. If, yeah, you, guys, if you guys haven't seen that movie, check it out. Yeah, um, I should check it out. I mean, it's <laughs> ba- it's not. I don't understand how kids would find that movie funny. It's not really? funny for kids. Oh, okay. Yeah, well, you never know. Because it takes itself like the pace of the comedy is either really slow or really fast. Okay. <laughs> well, well, sometimes kids just go to movies and they don't. Uh, it's very colorful. Yeah, it's just colorful, and there's Batman. Like they don't give a shit. Yes, yeah, true. <laughs> if it's uh, comedically, he never takes off the cowl. Perfect. Really? Yeah. Even when he's at home, he's always he's constantly wearing the cowl. That's awesome. The, um, one of my favorite. No, oh, wait, the- no, there is a part where he's Bruce Wayne. I'm sorry, because there's okay. a part where he goes there and he adopts Dick. Oh, okay. And there's the, the part where he's like, he's like, Br- Bruce Wayne. Um, um, uh, I, my friends call me Dick. And then, uh, <laughs> and then, uh, Bruce Wayne's like. Kids can be mean like that. Because <laughs> he's constantly yeah, yeah. the Batman voice. Uh, so what you're supposed to do here is break the tombstones. Because they keep spawning those tombstones? weird things. Uh, yeah, they'll they'll have kanji or whatever on them. Where? Those things. That right behind you. That thing. Oh. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Cryptic. <laughs> yeah, Welcome and there's like the four more. <laughs> <laughs> funny, yeah. funny joke. I thought of a name for our fans. What? If if uh, if ducks. they like it, no, I hate that. Uh, well, but if you want to know what the name of the fans is, <sighs> check out the next episode of Criticade. It's coming out tomorrow. See you guys. <laughs>